whether you and your team member follow agile practices in the business i think everybody will say yes but when i ask this questions with many team members across the companies i got varied answer of what exactly agility means some people answered agile if you are agile you will able to deliver fast some people said if you are agile whatever your delivery will be defect free i have got also the response agility means that your total cost will come down i think these are maybe the side effect of agility in my opinion agility is all about ability to handle unknowns and let me give a parallel example here earlier we had manufacturing industries we still have manufacturing industries in manufacturing industry what happens let's say you are planning to roll out trucks so you will prepare the blueprint of a truck you will review that maybe you will prepare a model of that truck and after that you will put the assembly line you know that which parts are needed how they need to get assembled then you will put assembly line and you will make sure that this assembly line produce those trucks uh, at very you know efficiently without any defects so yeah that was good and that was high productivity and we have heard many things of that but now if i take equal and let's say in the software world this is not the situation you never sort of produce identical code multiple times remember in manufacturing industry you put the assembly line to manufacture those identical trucks uh, and those assembly line produce those trucks uh, with big numbers and they has to be same and you are duplicating the things but here in the software industry it's different every time you write a new code so now what does it mean in agility in the software business in the software business earlier we used to follow the waterfall model there what used to happen you take the requirement from the customer and then you know you do the requirement analysis post that design and uh, used to happen then coding and testing and then used to ship to the customer and because software is the way trucks are tangible software is not tangible it's intangible you can't see it unless it get but it performs so whatever the requirements were there and what are the requirement given versus what has been noted down by the business people what has been coded till it get executed it was never clear what exactly will come out so what used to happen in waterfall model you take the requirement and finally when you deliver there used to be mismatch and which used to result in lot of let's say fight between vendor and customer because you know everybody used to, used to prove the point okay no no you have not given this requirement this is what is the meaning of that and that is where the this agile thing came into the software so what does it mean it means you have taken the requirement and you have broken down in the multiple chunks of mvp which is minimum viable products and you are quickly able to show those minimum viable product to the your customer at a small interval and in case if he provides a feedback there you incorporate that feedback and give the next set of uh, delivery in the next cycle like that in a iterative manner you along with the customer or maybe the other stakeholder keep on working so earlier let's say for the total delivery it was taking 6 month it means let's say at the 6 month only the delivery was made now maybe you may be delivering every 2 weeks or let's say every month so total time may still be 6 months but earlier what used to happen when you deliver after 6 months then customer used to say no this does not match what i have told and maybe next 3 4 months goes into all those ugly fights or the discussion or the testing by the customer but here you have started delivering those mvp products from the first month onward and if you 
told any change you incorporate in the second month and in the third month so after six month or maybe after seventh month whatever has been delivered customer has already seen is tested is given his feedback he also knows what is coming and accordingly the final deliveries have been made so that is the main thing of agility that is able to handle the change management request the unknowns or the feedback which your customer is giving and this is very much important in the software world but yeah according to me agility is required in all professional including in our personal life also ability to handle uh, identifying the things in the mvp things and ability to handle and ability to handle the change management but from the software world perspective agility means you should be able to handle the change management request you should be able to handle the unknowns and should have the ability to incorporate that and deliver and now for doing this the infrastructure what is needed is like you will require devops the continuous integration continuous deployment continuous testing uh, automation all those things but those are the things to enable it finally so that your customer can keep on seeing the minimum viable product at a regular interval at a defined frequency quickly and you should be able to take the feedback from your customer and incorporate and deliver those set of changes in the next cycle so this is what according to me agility means and now again look at your team and ask them are they following the agile practices so if you have any comment please provide those comment in the comment section below i have written many articles uh, related to agility you can find it out on my website www.raknamsingh.com thank you